So apparently there's been a lot of discussion concerning Marvel and Disney Plus specifically concerning maybe not doing so many extended Disney Plus series for characters and instead focusing more on or working more on the feature presentations or specials that they uh, have started doing, especially with the release of Werewolf by Night. Apparently, Werewolf by Night has been getting some good some good buzz and some good uh, reviews for Disney Plus and for what they did there. And I thought there, I thought Werewolf by Night was okay. Okay, I thought it was okay. I liked Man Thing, uh, and I and I liked the idea of what they were doing with the production of the actual uh, special itself, with harkening back to the uh, old days of the black and white and the practical effects. Uh, I thought that was uh, I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, the story was just okay for me. Uh, enough, enough with with the with the food. Okay, too much, too much food stuff with uh, the comics themselves, and too much, too much with this, this just padding stuff. Anyway, I digress. Uh, what Disney Plus and Marvel needs to realize is that you don't want people wishing something was over. You want people wishing there was something more because they loved what they just saw so much. Leave them wanting more. And I say that because in this context, you, you have the perfect opportunity with feature presentations. Uh, they are discussing that uh, currently with uh, Nova instead of giving Nova a, um, a series. I mean, not, seriously, not everyone needs a series. Not everything needs a six episode, eight episode padded out, long drawn out series. It just, that's what, that's what makes people zone out. That's what makes people not like it. it, it people like me, especially. And, and there's plenty of people out there, whether you agree with that or not, tighten it up tighten up the story tighten up the production make get back to writing that compels people to want more you have to have good writing as the basis for this kind of stuff it's not about pushing whatever political or social agendas or ideas or ideology just get back to the core of the character and then make it make a compelling protagonist and antagonist and tell a story that leaves you wanting more and not just wishing it was over with and watching paint dry. Uh, the, the Lord of the Lord of the Rings series right now that's still going on, the Power of the Rings series is an example of that. My God, look, the production is top notch. You can definitely tell that. But the, the story, the, everything is so drug out and the multiple storylines. This could have easily, this should have been, at most, it should have been a, a four episode Rings of Power series. <laughs> I mean, seriously. Uh, the, anyway, I digress. Back to Marvel and Disney Plus. Guys, I think they made a wise choice. Uh, I, I think they have a potential for having made a wise choice in regards to the Armor Wars because that was supposed to be a Disney Plus series. But now they're looking at now they're making it an actual movie unto itself and i'm like okay i think that's that potentially can be a lot better where you get in and get out but the other advantage that i think that they have to doing feature presentations instead of everything having to be a series from the from the start is that if you do a really good feature presentation make it tight and make it right leave people wanting more that is that that to me could be a great springboard and a launching pad for that particular Thank character you. and or Gathering property to produce more if you have the buzz coming from a pre Werewolf feature presentation that's exclusively on disney plus and it opens the door these old movies, if it gets good reviews and good positive and buzz then it get then it's maybe go on and stretch it out to a series or in this take it directly from the silver screen depending on entirely new the character and entirely the actors new and actresses of the MCU that you have involved in it unusual, and make it be a launching point let it be a testing ground so to say 
people are I love monster movies if, if because there's such allegories for the feeling different from you everyone may else. Just with Michael that idea and move on to something and else. Composing. Because we get to life lean is too short for crap. Of the too short for crap. I mean, seriously. Enough of this. These Marvel Disney Plus series have not gotten any better. Some of the scariest things I saw as a kid were just the shadows of things. All the awful things you hear. They give us a second season of She Hulk. That was horrible. That was horrible. The scale and imagination of this project is wonderful. There's a lot of risk. I thought the best way was introducing a world that will ultimately become quite important to the future of the MCU. It's time to like put something different out into the world. It's going to be so cool. Maybe we shouldn't go straight to a series. Maybe we should go to a future presentation. Do a short, hour, 15 minute short movie and have it on Disney Plus and see what it does and see how it pans out and go from there. Uh, we also have a Guardians of the Galaxy like Christmas special coming up as well, uh, which will be a similar type of feature presentation as to what they did with Werewolf by, Werewolf by Night. But obviously, I mean, it's the Guardians of the Galaxy. That to me is going to be kind of skewed as it is. People like Guardians of the Galaxy uh, to this point, so I mean, I don't, I don't really consider that uh, in the testing phase for this or the or the research gathering phase for this, but. I mean, you never know. But yeah, it's like, yeah, if we're, if we're going to do something like this, that like they've announced the Echo series, nobody wants an Echo series. All you're doing is pandering. All you're doing is trying to, nobody wants an Echo series. Nobody is clamoring. Nobody is showing up besides whoever you paid to show up at cons asking about Echo. Nobody is doing this. So, so if you're going to continue to do this, but I know you are because you've already started the series, that is, a, is an example of something that should have been made to a feature presentation instead of whatever, whatever it's going to be, a six to eight episode uh, series on Disney+. Plus. Nobody is asking for that. What a monumental waste of time and energy. You've got a good idea going with the feature presentations, Disney. You need to fine tune that and let that be the launching ground, the launching pad, or, or the, the testing ground for things going forward. I, I would suggest that maybe it should be a stack where you do the presentation. If you get positive presentation, then the series. And depending on how positive the presentation is, is accepted and reviewed and stuff, Maybe you could even bypass the series and go straight to the silver screen and expand that universe. But enough of the, all this padding, enough padding of story, enough of drawing out and just kind of, it's like, you know, five hours of content for five hours of content's sake. It's not, it's not working out. It's time to focus on quality. It's time to move up. It's time to step up and it's time to get better.